What we will be using is dumpling wraps, flavor made, salt free, coconut oil. I'm doing two batches. So one batch is going to be with coconut oil and one is going to be with G, clear fried butter, and some might have the vegetable flakes to give you like that garden cracker taste. And we're going to sprinkle a little chia seeds on it just to give it that extra healthy kick. I've already took the time out to melt me a little butter because I will not be making a whole lot. So let's hop right into it, you guys. Now I want to speak to you guys. Say good morning. Oh my goodness, she gonna blow y'all ears out. Hey you guys, I've already laid some out on the plate. I literally cut the package open and lift them out. Some like their crackers thin. So these would be the thinner ones. And then these two right here are two layered. But, I mean, it's still gonna be pretty thin. But this is like extra thin. And so all you're gonna do is... So you guys, I have to stop it for a moment because Mimi would like to help out. And all you're going to do is take your fork. Or if you got like a toothpick and you're just going to basically do what she's doing. You're just going to poke holes in it. Okay, Mimi, spread it out some. Girl, you just going to find them. This way, look, this way it look like cooking in the kitchen with your child. Um, do you have anything? Or it's your turn. I will be using my finger to rub the butter on the cracker. I did wash my hands. My nails might look a little bad, but my hands are clean. Okay. Okay. I'm glad to see you too, Pookie. You know, they're just like us when we play. You know, that's pretty good. You want to take whatever season of your choice. We have to get out of here before the people and their dogs arrive for their morning run. Then he's well, just gonna Everybody's sprinkle it with some seasoning. Hold on, right, you do the next one. I've already started this one. And then we're gonna cut them in angles. Good morning, good morning, loves. We're about to hop right on into it. Sorry, you can't hear me. The little one's on the phone. So what we will be making this morning, good morning, God bless. Okay, so what we'll be making this morning is rice. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, no. Anyway, what I'm going to make right now, before I even really get into work or anything like that, my kids are weird. They eat dinner for groceries and breakfast for dinner. I could, you know, as long as they eat and I do it. So what they actually want, because the schedule just got them so out of whack, what they actually want is rice, chili, and fries. So that might be what I end up cooking for them, because that's what they requested. When I ask, I tend to just go ahead and fix what they want. Because I would rather cook what they want than to cook and they don't even eat it, because that's a waste of food. That's just how I am. Y'all let me know how y'all like but before I do any of that, my rice is already on. Before I do any of that, I'm going to make homemade crackers out of dumpling wrap. So, let's get to it. So, I already had my pan. Oh, oh, it's a little warm. I already had my oven preheating and I already had my pan in the oven. And basically what I'm, you're going to do, you're going to lift up your cracker. I don't have the paper to go on my pan, but it's okay. And we're just gonna put them on the cookie sheet pan. So, a lot of stores are really so out of everything I wanted. 
sell um they will sell their crackers, yeast, aluminum foil. You know, some stuff I wouldn't even think they would be selling out of personal. I'm like, oh my goodness. I'm finna go and do some more and I'll be right back. What is it? Yes, it is. <laughs> something else. No, you can't just eat them. They have to be cooked. You can cut them in squares. You can cut them in triangles. You're doing a mixture. No, you're not going to cut it. No. no, not right now. No. So basically, you're just gonna keep repeating what you've already done. Well, I'm sure the next time. You have to be really gentle with them because they easily tear. Okay, I'm gonna have to pause this. Uh, I'm gonna have to stop the camera real quick because my song just came on, and you know, I got a jam to it real quick, y'all. But you know, I'm gonna be right back. So this is not the end result, but this is right before it go in the oven. Yes, you can see the different sizes, and yes, the fruit I played in a little bit. But you know what? That's what chef babies do, and I'm still going to cook it, okay? Excuse me, queen. So my oven was already on. It was heated to 350. I'm just going to pop that on in there. Okay. And this is... We have a special guest with us right now. She wants to say hi. Hey guys. It's my first day helping us. And this time. Ah, it's my birthday. My birthday is going to be coming up next year. Yay! No, this year, Queen. 
Okay, you guys, so we're making canned chili, but instead of making canned chili, just regular canned chili, I'm going to show you how to make it your own. And this is how I make it my own. And, you know, let me know if anyone else does canned chili, but also spices it up. So, I have pinto beans. I'm thinking about doing two of these, or I might just do one. Uh-oh, did I lose y'all? It's okay, y'all back now. So I have one can of this. So it's one can of whole milk chili water. Mm. Okay. So we're gonna do bell pepper, onions, carrot, and sweet potato. Um, I, they don't really eat sweet potatoes, so I find different ways to incorporate it. So it's finely cut, so it's gonna kind of blend in some my some my ears and my nuts. And I'm only gonna do a couple of more little bitty strips. Watch out for y'all fingers. I be watching out for mine every now and then. I get my nail, but you know what? I'm just playing. Okay, so I'm gonna finally cut that up. Then I'm gonna put the rest in the deep fryer for myself. Mm, they look so good like that. They look okay. Two more. And put the rest in the deep fryer. Uh, I think I lost one. Stop right. I will give you more in a minute. Don't make me call Journey to come get you.
I was gonna order me some new knives a lot last night, but then I don't know. I changed my mind, one? but truth is, one? No. I have like some big knives that I just don't use because my children find that. ways to be in everything, so they're like lit up. The and then when I start cooking, no. those knives are never on my mind. No. So. But it just came on my mind just now that my hand was tired. But anyway, I don't feel like going to go get them. Because they're put up in the garage. So I just might buy me some more knives. A little smaller ones. Because I've seen this really pretty set online. There's copper. And the handles were also a copper color looking. $12.99. You want to leave out, Mimi? Hey, Queen, do you? Uh, no. Okay, then. Sit down. I know that was you, Queen. And I'll go get somebody for you. I will. That was No, it wasn't. Look, see? Mimi ain't the one who just threw that white thing. She's not. Mimi, show me what you No, she don't need to show me nothing before I kick y'all out the kitchen. Sorry, y'all. She's not in the mood for it right now. I took out three carrots with true food. Mimi, that's it. I'm gonna let me play. I feel like one carrot seems to be enough right now. Because I'm not, like, making a whole big pot. Let's make a little something, something. You know, I'm losing carrots everywhere. It's not time to eat yet. Well, I'm hungry. Let's have some milk in a bottle. You don't have a bottle, so no, you can't. Let's have a cup. So, 
y'all, the next one I'm going to use this because I really am tired of cutting already. gonna notice it oh but look how yummy that look look like cheese anyway i might be going like vegan for the thing um, definitely been watching a lot of recipes and i really can't wait to give them a try if i don't go vegan I probably will be going after Okay, well, go get her. Look what she did. With the pandemic, I was going to start my keto because I'm definitely want to get in shape. I just want to be able to you know, run with the kids and, you know, not lose my breath type of stuff. But, um, yeah, with the pandemic, I haven't been able to just get a shake like I thought I would be able to. But, that's okay. We shall be starting pretty soon. Hopefully, you guys. Hopefully. Pray for me. Uh, I must have lost y'all again. Man, y'all just don't want to. Okay, you guys. So, I did not cut my onions or my bell peppers up on camera you know i can always do it again if y'all want to see me cut the onion and bell peppers on camera let me know i'm probably gonna do it sauteing my onions and my bell peppers yeah i'm about to go ahead and drop in my carrots and sweet potatoes Stop. That's why I sweep it down. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's my hands off. Oh, I'm being a winner. 
Um, so... Okay, you guys got one can open, and I'm gonna pour the whatever you want to consider it, the juice that be on the beans off, and then I'm gonna rinse them. I always rinse my beans off. We have to get all this sodium and salt on.
Smart beans. I have another little small can of chili and I could add it, but I'm not. Leave it like that. Now, now we're just going to cover it up. He loves some more, so it's taking this time. Like my chili hot, love it. It's fresher out the can. I want it hot, hot, hot. Okay, and then when it's done, when we plate it, we're gonna sprinkle some cheese on it. Mm -mm -mm. Somebody come over, they're gonna see all them ingredients in it, and they're gonna swear it's for real, for real, homemade. But it's just that quick top. Couple of more ingredients. Quick little special chili. Okay, you feel me? You know, sometimes, not all the time, but I do try to clean up as I go. Because, you know, I have multiple children. I don't want to be in no kitchen all day. Clean. Starting to kick in now. Okay, y'all, so, you know, if you clicked on this video, thanks for watching. Let me know if you all make your own can chili slash homemade chili. Or do you all add any little extra ingredients to your canned chili? Or you just don't use canned chili at all? Y'all let me know. Thanks for watching. Good day, good morning, good evening. And please, don't forget to subscribe. I want to know that someone out there is watching. Leave a comment. Adios, amigos. You guys, so we got the potatoes uncut. Different sizes, different shapes. That's how we like them. We like everybody. That's why we like our potatoes. Um, yeah, I did. Um, the rice, the homemade crackers. Yeah. 